Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, cheers. Listen, happy new year, it's almost, it's already new year in New York, new year, bitch, I don't know everywhere because I don't know about the time zones, but happy, happy new year for you guys if you've already celebrated your new year. I myself, hey Google, what time is it? It's 9.31. It's 9.31 and look at me. So if you're new to my channel, my name is Sebastian. I welcome you guys with open arms. I have the last tea of 2020. Gabby DiMartino said, you know what, bitch? <laughs> no one's going to celebrate their new year until I get the most watched video on New Year, bitch. Well, okay. So I have some tea. Then we'll talk. I'm actually in the middle. Okay, let me just tell you something. I have to. This is, it's 9.30. I have to fold my clothes. I have to, because I, I, I did laundry today. I don't know about you guys, but like, New Year's, I like to have everything clean, everything pretty, you know, just like fresh. So I did laundry and I started yesterday. I started yesterday and I'm still not done and it's 9.30 and I still have to go shower. I still have to try and get all cute and stuff. So listen, anyways, what are you doing? Let me know in the comments. Okay, so um, Gabby DiMartino and Colin Hurt, when our, our, her now fiance, they got engaged on Thanksgiving and they actually kept it a damn secret. I mean, here's the thing. I feel like sometimes these like celebrities and stuff, well also, you know, she's had some kind of dramas in her in her past, you know, in 2020. Um, you know, you know what I'm talking about, girl. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I just think it's like, it's super cute, you know what I mean? It's like, it's a nice way to end the year. It's a nice, it's also, you know what I thought? A lot of people are spending their holidays alone and all her like big fans, this was probably like such a nice treat, you know? So, I mean, I'm happy she posted, you know, and, and I have to say, she really has created this like magical world. You know what I mean? Like, it's like Trisha, they've created their own world. It's like, everything is pretty. Everything is aesthetically pleasing, you know? And here I am, look, here I am with dog hair all over my Britney shirt, which has bite marks of me. I guess I've realized that when I get anxious, I bite my shirt. I didn't know I had this quality, but now I do. Happy New Year. <laughs> Happy New Year. I'm drinking um, rosé. Mm. So she got engaged. And yeah, so it's 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 been an hour and it already has more than 42,000 views. I'm pretty sure it's going to be on the trending page by tomorrow. So. That's a great way for her to end her year. Besides, you know, the drama and everything, I think. You know, love is beautiful, bitch. Love is beautiful. Um, I actually met, um, fun, fun, fun st little story time. I met her sister, um, not, not Nick, what is it, Gabby and Nikki? Is it Nikki? You know who I'm talking about, not her, but like the other sister who's who she never kind of appears. And, um, okay, so my husband and I, we had a cafe in Hollywood, right? And one day, okay, okay sorry. So one day, her sister, their sister comes in, you know, and I think her name is Alexis, maybe? Comment below. Well, this was back in like 2000, I want to say 16. I didn't really know who they were, to be honest with you. Like, I had no idea. Well, she came in. And um, she ordered an iced coffee. And I was like, um, you know, okay. I didn't think anything of it, you know, because like, we're, you know, Hollywood, everyone drinks, you know, iced coffees. But anyways, so she's sitting there and I, I told her that I was, oh no, she was like, so how, like, we just started like talking and she was like, so, um, I asked, probably asked her like, how was your day? And then she asked me, how was my day? And I was like, Oh, I'm good. I'm just, I'm just a little frustrated because uh, my Wi-Fi is not letting me upload my YouTube video. So she looked at me and she was like, "Oh, you, you, you're a YouTuber." And I'm like, "Yeah, well, you know, struggling YouTuber, trying to make it, you know, all these things." And she's like, "Oh, that's so sweet." Oh my God, I broke my pillow pillowcase. Fuck. Um, she's like, "Oh, that's so sweet." Yeah, I know a thing about YouTube. And I was like, "Oh, really? Are you a YouTuber?" And I think at that point she could really tell that like. I had no idea who she was or like anything. Um, so she was like, yeah, well actually my uh, my family there, my sisters, 
they're very big on YouTube, look them up. So I, you know, looked them up and I was like, oh my God, like millions of views. Well, I was like, wow, that's amazing. And I'm like, what do you do? And she was like, well, I'm an actress. And I was like, oh, that's amazing. She's like, yeah, well, you know, struggling actress, like trying to make it, blah, blah, blah. And then we started talking about, like, I asked her, like, how does she feel with her sisters, you know, like, um, with their fame and stuff? Like, has it affected her or, you know, whatever? And she was like, no, I mean, um, it hasn't really affected me. Um, but, you know, sometimes it's difficult, I guess, to, you know, sort of to try and keep up and, you know, something like that. And I told her, now, if you guys don't know this, so back in the day, Jessica Simpson, she had a show on, on MTV called The Newlyweds. And um, her sister, Ashley, she came afterwards when Jessica was like on the prime of her, of her, like she was like huge at this point. So, um, oh my God, this is so bad. Um, so she was in her like prime and there was always like this, kind not like a joke, but like this thing saying like, you know, Ashley Simpson is always in the shadows of Jessica Simpson. And even Je Ashley has a song called Living in the Shadow of someone else's dream, trying to find a hand to hold, but everyone felt cold to me. So um, I was like, oh my God, you are like Ashley Simpson. Oh my God, I should not have said that. And I honestly, I didn't even mean it. Like I, we were talking about like her, you know, living, you know, in, in not, she didn't say like in their shadow, but she was like, you know, just, sort of trying to make it my own. And I was like, look, you you can't compare, you know, anyone's. And she was like, no, I love my sisters. I'm so happy for my sisters. Um, I just want to make, you know, name of my own. And I was like, yeah, of course. Like, I'm going to throw this away. Yeah, of course. Like, I totally get it. And she was like, I'm so proud of my sisters and everything they've done. And I was like, well, I'm sure they're very proud of you too. And, you know, I was telling her that like, just because someone you love is ed more advanced than you doesn't mean that you're not, you know what I mean? So I tried to make her feel better. I don't know how much she liked my Ashley Simpson comment, to be honest, but it is what it is. So anyways, I don't know why I just told you that story time. Oh, it's because I mean, it's close to them. <sighs> you guys, I have so much to do. You have no idea, but um, I just wanted to come on here and also just sort of tell you guys that um, this 2020, I know, has not been the easiest. Um, it has definitely shown a lot of people their strength. Um, you've had to learn your own strength. And um, I just want to say that whatever you're feeling right now, if you're feeling low, if you're feeling anything, I got you. And I really do mean that. I really want you always to know that I'm here for you. I'm very grateful for what what we have built together, our little family. I love it with all my heart and I'm very grateful for you. I know if you are feeling alone or sad, I'm I'm there with you, girl. I'm there, okay? I'll, I'm there. So you're never alone. Just remember that. I love you so much. Happy New Year. I cannot wait for next year in two hours. It's going to be a beautiful and blessed year. We have to have faith, be grateful, but most importantly, most importantly, faith, be grateful, be thankful. And most importantly, I know, let's start that over. Listen, you guys, as long as we have faith, gratitude, thankfulness, we're going to have a beautiful year. I'm there with you. Most importantly, let's learn to love ourselves inside and out and Remember, the rest is still unwritten. Feel the rain on your skin. No one else can feel it for you. Only you can let it in. No one else, no one else can speak the words on your lips. Treat yourself with words unspoken. Live your life with arms wide open. Today is where your book begins. The rest is still unwritten happy new year everyone i love you all and 
2021, honey. It's going to be a very blessed one for all of us. Bye, guys. See you next year.